universal set is 1 to 13. A equals multiples of 3, B equals even numbers. Complete the Venn diagram for this information. So the universal set is all of the values which we need to place inside this Venn diagram. Now the first thing we'll want to do is label these circles A and B. So any multiples of 3 will be placed in this section here. Any even numbers will be placed in this section here. And any even numbers which are also multiples of 3 will be placed in this central section here. Any numbers which do not fit into any of these categories will be placed outside the circle but still inside this rectangle. So we can start off with 1. 1 is an odd number and is not a multiple of 3. So therefore, 1 needs to be placed outside the circles. 2 is an even number, however is not a multiple of 3. So therefore, we'll just place it in the circle B. 3 is a multiple of 3. However, it is an odd number, so we can place this in A. 4 is an even number, however, it is not a multiple of 3. 5 is an odd number, which is not a multiple of 3. 6 is a multiple of 3 and is an even number, so we'll go where A and B overlap. 7 is an odd number, which is not a multiple of 3. 8 is even but not a multiple of 3. 9 is a multiple of 3, however it is an odd number. 10 is an even number and not a multiple of 3. 11 is an odd number, which is not a multiple of 3. 12 is a multiple of 3 and an even number. And finally 13 is an odd number which is not a multiple of 3. And this question is worth four marks. We'll get one mark for labelling the circles correctly. And we'll get the remaining three marks for having the full Venn diagram completed correctly.